Hey, it's Patrick Canetta. I hope you're having a great day. In this video, we're talking about the power of having a daily ritual. And the reason I use the word ritual instead of just a regular daily routine is because daily ritual is much deeper than a routine. You know, a ritual is something you take so seriously, like you, it's religious to you. You know, it's almost like, you know, it's just so important to you at the deepest level of your being. So that's why I use the word ritual. And the importance of having this daily ritual is, you know, it's so important because if you think about it, your entire life is made up of individual days. You know, every single day that passes is basically your life. Think about it. You know, it's not just, you know, oh, looking at it over the long term of your life. You know, people don't look at it on a daily basis and that's so true. That's how it is. You know, people just move from one job to the next. You know, they work on their, their schooling, they work on this or this or this, and they look at things long term and they just, they don't think about it on a daily basis. They don't really seize the day. And this can be huge when you can realize this, when you understand that your entire life is made up of individual days. And if you can take control of that day, then you can take control of your life. When you begin to understand that, then you can really take things to the next level and really start to change your life. And, you know, think about it. How do you change your life? Well, you got to have that daily ritual. You got to develop those tasks that you're completing every day in order to go in the direction you want to go in. So think about where you are in your life right now. Think about your situation. Think about your career. Think about every aspect of yourself, every aspect of your life. And compare that to where you want to be in your life. Think about the greatest version of yourself you could possibly be, the best life you could possibly live. And who doesn't want to achieve those things? Because that that's literally leads to the best possible life, the most happy life, the most fulfilling life, the most wealthy, healthy life you could possibly live. Who doesn't want to live that life? So imagine that. Imagine yourself and visualize that. And, you know, compare that to where you are right now and figure out what you need to do every single day in order to get there and start executing that. That's all it is. Like I said, think about what you need to do in order to achieve your career goals, to achieve all the things you want to achieve in your life, your wildest dreams. You know, it doesn't, you know, you don't have to be realistic because if you believe you can achieve anything, then you can truly, you know, you can truly achieve it. If you really, really believe in yourself and believe in the universe and have faith, you know, as long as you have that, you can achieve anything. So all you need to do, like I said, is, you know, figure out exactly what it is that you need to do every single day in order to get there. For example, if you want to become a professional athlete, then obviously you need to be training every single day. If you want to be a professional musician, you need to be practicing every single day. If you want to get a certain career, you need to start working every single day in order to get that. You know, what do you need to do in order to get there? That's all it is. And like I said, develop this daily routine. And this can be done by writing a list of tasks that you need to do. Like I said, training, exercising, whatever it is. If you're pursuing a path of personal growth, put something down for physical health, mental health, you know, exercise, yoga, reading books, like anything you want to achieve in your life, anything you want to add to your life, anything, any skill you want to learn, like I said, no matter what it is, no matter what your goals are, figure out what you need to do every day. And like I said, make that daily checklist. And that daily checklist is basically your daily ritual. And start to develop this ritual and start to develop this routine in which you are executing these things every single day. And once you begin to do this, once you can start to build those healthy habits and build those productive habits, then you can really start to change the direction that your life is going in. Because think about it, if you, like I said, just start with one day, start with tomorrow, write down the things that you want to get done and step outside your comfort zone, break, completely break free of that comfort zone because that is going to limit you. Break free of your limits. Like I said, you know, thinking your way into a hole basically by not believing in yourself, not believing you can accomplish something. You know, just totally get rid of that and believe in yourself, have an open mind. And like I said, just start with tomorrow. You know, like I said, what kind of tasks do you need to accomplish tomorrow in order to just get on the right track towards your goals? And like I said, just start executing it. You know, build these habits, develop this checklist. And it'll take some time to develop this, of course. It'll take some time to, first of all, come up with the ideas for your checklist by, first of all, getting the right information, learning about these different things, learning about the things you want to accomplish, learning about your goals, learning about the skills you want to attain. And, you know, like I said, once you can get that information and just start to develop it and it might take you months, it might take you years. It took me a long, long time to actually develop the ritual and develop the routine that I wanted to develop. And it took me a long time. I procrastinated a lot. I put things off a lot. But if you can just start with that one day 
and build those habits, like I said, over time, if you really have that desire to want to improve, to want to achieve your goals, then it'll be easy. And like I said, as soon as you really start to develop those habits, then it'll start to become ritual. If you miss, like I said, if you've been doing these things for a long time, these productive and healthy things for a long time every single day, and there's a day where you miss one of these things, you're gonna feel bad about it. You're gonna get anxiety because you didn't finish that you know, task. So you're literally going to rewire your brain to accomplish your goals, to want to progress forward and have you're gonna develop a growth mindset. So the best thing you can do, like I said, is just do your best. Just don't beat yourself up if you aren't making the progress you want to make because that is another thing that holds a lot of people back. You know, be persistent, have that long-term, you know, goal, have a definite goal you want to achieve, definite goals in general you want to achieve, and just keep working and put your head down. And like I said, begin to develop those rituals. And as soon as you start to develop the ritual, then like I said, you're going to have that momentum and everything is just going to pull you forward. And you know, that work you're putting in every day isn't going to feel like work. You know, as long as you are basing it around your passions and basing it around the things you truly want to accomplish in your life. If you have that passion and have that definite purpose and have that persistence, then as soon as you develop that ritual, you're just on the right track. And like I said, you might need to redirect your path. You might need to redirect the direction you're going in. You might need to rethink your career. You might need to rethink a lot of things. But that's part of the process. It's part of learning about who you are and learning about your passions and learning about your purpose in life. And as soon as you start to do that, and like I said, develop that ritual, then you'll be on the path to success, on the path to happiness and the best possible life and becoming your best possible self. Hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. I'd love to hear about that. Don't forget to check out the description. Reach out to me on Instagram with any other questions or comments you guys have. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Got plenty more coming soon. Your mind is much more powerful than you think. Have a great day. Peace.